What's up, y'all? It's your man, Bobby Wash, a producer, singer, songwriter, filmmaker. This is my Bobby Wash and vlog channel. Please subscribe and uh, click the notification bell. Um, this video is to help those um, of you who have uh, trouble seeing this, what I'm seeing right now, many devices and your integrity showing up. I had trouble for like two days straight, called Sweetwater. They couldn't help me. I um, went on Facebook. Pretty much they told me the same thing I already knew, um, but I did something different um, to make mine work. I actually had to do a factory reset uh, um, first on my um, on my Integra. So let me get let's go over to the Integra real quick. All right. Okay. So now we have the rolling Integra. The first thing you want to make sure you have your your um, wireless dongle in the USB reader right there. That's the first thing. Then you want to just power on your unit. Then you want to go ahead and go to menu and do a factory reset first. That's that would have saved me a whole lot of time. For some reason, you got to do this. Um, go to system. I'm sorry. Go to utility right there. Go to utility. Press enter and do a factory reset. Do that. Then restart the machine. Once you restart the machine, now you do the other steps everybody else knows about. Um, you go to menu. First thing you want to do is go to uh, system. Then you want to uh, scroll down on this under um, setup. Go to setup. Let's go back to setup. Right there, set up, right? Go on here to set up. And then you want to come down to that USB driver. Make sure it's on MIDI only. MIDI only, okay? No um, no uh, audio plus MIDI and vendor. Make sure it's generic, okay? You want to slide over to MIDI. And then come down. The first thing you want to do is check the device ID channel. This channel needs to stay on 17 because that's the one that's set up in the Integra editor. Keep it on 17, okay? Channel, uh, that doesn't matter. Um, I got mine at 16. I saw somebody at the 15. That doesn't matter. But uh, but right here needs to be turned off. US uh, MIDI through needs to be turned off, okay? Then once you turn it off, make sure you press shift and edit to write it. Shift, edit, and then you want to write it, okay? That way it takes. Then you want to exit out. All right, press exit twice, then come back in, press menu again. Now you want to go down to wireless. Press enter. You want to come over to options. All right, come over to options. Press enter in your options. And here you want to have the wireless information at zero. Um, ID, then you want to have the hawk on. That's going to be turned off, so turn that on. Leave that at one at the bottom of the channel, okay? Um, press exit. And then you're going to have your code right there, the hot code. That's my code. You're going to put your code in. My code won't work for you, okay? Um, so go ahead and put your code in. Um, that's going to be into your editor. You're going to put that right here into your editor. When you go into, let's go to systems on the iPad. Go to systems. Go to Wi-Fi. And then the Integra, mine's already connected. But it's going to be down here, um, you know, down here where your, where your connections are. You're going to select it and put in that code that was at the bottom of your hawk. So you put that five-digit code in there. Boom. You come over to the rolling. Come over to the rolling. And then you should be, uh, this is going to be at normal mode. It should be at normal already set for you, normal. Then you want to open up here. Make sure the device is 17 like I told you before at the rolling. It's going to be right here, 17. Don't change this number. Keep that there. Just click many devices and it should be in there. Okay, if you have trouble, restart both the unit and restart the iPad again. Okay, but that should get it uh, done for you. I had trouble, like I said, and, um, you know, nobody in the Facebook group could really help me. They kept saying, hey, make sure that you have your, your hawk right. And I'm like, man, all that stuff is right. But I just had to do a factory reset for some reason. It needed to be reset. All right, and my unit is brand new. I didn't buy it used. I bought it brand new. So, um, and I'm using the iPad 4 uh, Air, I believe. Let's go. See which one I'm using here. I'm using, should be in about, about. Yeah, I'm using the uh, iPad Air uh, fourth generation. I'm on 15.01. So, you know, if it's a new unit, it should work. All right. Peace and blessings. Please subscribe. These three hats have three different meanings. I'm going to break them down hat by hat. This hat represents me the family man, husband and father. This hat represents me, the musician, producer, singer, songwriter, street promoter. 
This hat represents me as a filmmaker, feature films, and vlogging. These hats also represent where I'm from, Miami. The cliche, you're a jack of all trades, but somehow I managed to master all three. I'm Bobby Washington, and these are my vlogs.